Hey everybody, welcome back to Fallout 4 at the uh, airport. Um, today, we are going to continue working on this big old building right here. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be putting some oversized pillars in, in the front here, on the left and on the right. Uh, kind of between, like right right out of that crossroads of the two or of the uh, four pieces of flooring that make the corners up. I want to try to get these pillars right in the center there. And... And then I'm going to start working, I guess, on the bottom floor. I might even try to get an idea for, like, floor three at, this, uh, at the same time. And I also have to watch my size limit because the size limit is getting pretty high up there. And I'm not even close to really where I want to be for this settlement build so we're gonna have to exploit the heck out of the game a little bit more um, but hopefully the gun trick works really well I, i'm pretty sure it does i have no reason to doubt any of my uh commenters or subscribers um but yeah i'm really curious to see how much i can actually put down before that size limit is like completely filled up because i mean if you look at it right there there really isn't a whole lot left i'm hoping at the very least i can get the pillars in the wall the, the front wall in and maybe like the roof at the very least that's what i want to get done to get these man-made pillars in i'm going to be using uh the post glitch and there's gonna be a little bit of a gap at the bottom of it but that's okay and uh by the way uh, speaking about my subscribers, uh, I checked earlier today and I have 91 subscribers. That's e even more than I had only a few be uh, days back when I did the first part of this video when I had 85. So all you uh, new subscribers, uh, thank you so much. And all your returning subscribers, uh, returning to my channel to see how this uh, monstrosity of a build is going to, you know be doing uh thank you i really do appreciate it uh i know that that this is going to be a project and a half uh to build this building the way that i want to but i'm going to give it a go um but yeah i uh i really do really really do appreciate everyone uh for just listening uh to me and and seeing what i have to do and hopefully learning some stuff from me um i know that uh the little bit of knowledge that I've gained in, in this game uh, is not going to waste just on me. I get to share a little bit of it with everyone, and I really, I, I, I like that. I like being able to do that. Um, anyway, yeah, I'm just uh, just doing the basic um, post or pillar uh, exploit or glitch or um, technique, I guess they call it now. And I'm really trying to get it pretty close to the middle of like that that plus up there like on the on the bottom part of the the flooring i try to i'm trying to get it to like dead center um it's probably gonna take a minute so i am going to either cut out or speed up this part of the video and i will get back to you momentarily All right, next thing on the list is we're going to put a wall onto the, the bottom uh, cement foundation piece. And we're going to kind of like cover up that little gap that's underneath there. Um, yeah, so it looks more realistic or possible than just floating there. Uh, I'm going to do that. I'm going to take uh, this same type of wall and I'm going to put it all around the bottom um, structure piece. And then when that's done, I'm going to do the same thing to the other side. And then I'm going to connect both sides uh, by maybe um, uh, some sort of doors. Something like that. There's going to be some sort of entrance way. Uh, once we've done that, um, I want to go and try to get the roof done, like I said. Uh, maybe try to get a feel for the next floor up. And... We'll continue to do that until the bottom's done. The next thing that I have to do here is I'm going to 
I'm going to use the mat trick or the ashtray trick, and I'm going to get the rest of this uh, warehouse wall around the bottom here. Um, I've showed you how to do this, I think, in other videos. If you get it too close to the other piece that's already in, in place, it's going to want to connect onto it. That's not what I want. I'm just trying to get around the thing. Um, you know, trial and error, I think... Uh, I might be putting these a little bit too close. I guess we'll find out in a second here. Um, when I'm done with this side, I'm probably going to just fast forward through the other side because it's pretty much it's practically the same thing that I'm doing with this side uh, that I'm going to do with the other side. And that's just a bit of a waste of time for everyone because I already showed you the process of my thinking, my thought process of getting this together. Um, I don't need to be redundant about it. And once that is done... Then we'll go on to the next part of this building. Um, this is probably just going to hide the whole thing, isn't it? Yeah, it's of course. All right, bring that back. Get the mat. Come on. All right, put the mat in the front there and hold down the A button on the controller or the X button on the PlayStation controller. And if it's not an Xbox controller, get that in place. Of course, you know, fidget it back and forth a little bit till it's kind of flushed at everything. And yeah, that that I think that looks pretty good. The other one, it looks a little too far, too far back, and I don't think it's completely connected right. Uh, I'm, I'm going to do the same thing. Like I said, I'm probably going to I'm going to fix where it is a little bit because it does look like it's a little bit crooked, and I'm putting all the walls kind of away from the the um, foundation. For this side of the wall, I decided to use the ashtray instead of the, the mat. It, uh, for some reason, just seemed to work a little bit better that way. Uh, this would be the last uh, piece because I got everything else kind of in place. And then I'm going to connect everything. All right, ashtray, get out the way. Uh, yep, just go there. So now we have this. Doesn't look too bad. And, uh, yeah, let's connect it. So this is what I was talking about. I'm actually going to stretch it out to the, uh, uh, the borderline of the settlement. And maybe even a little bit farther. And then in the middle here, I'm going to put some sort of, like, gate or a vault door or something. Actually, I don't even know if I have the vault door unlocked yet uh, in this game. I think I have to go through the vault 88 uh, to get the vault door. So this might be something that I want to change in the future. But, I mean, as of right now, let's uh, just get these walls in place, make it look kind of nice. And I'm getting really close to that, that size limit there. So... You know, I'm just going to keep on building until it says, you cannot build anymore. Nothing left to build or whatever the heck it is. And, um, yeah, we'll just go from there. Um, I'm kind of liking, I'm kind of liking the wood doors. And I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to push all those wood doors kind of together. Because they aren't really going in the way that I was hoping they would. So... I'm going to force them in place, and uh, hopefully I don't screw this up too bad. Um, that looks fairly lined up. Did I get to the end? Um, it looks like there's a little bit of a gap, and there's a lot of bit of gap. All right, let's try that again, and that's going to pick up the whole thing. All right. Um, yeah, let's just move it out the way. I'm sure you've seen me do this in other videos where I'm doing the same uh, section again uh, because the first time it wasn't quite flush enough. Um, I mean, it happens, and it's real. Uh, I'm not perfect <laughs> at doing this. I don't want to look like I'm perfect at doing this because that's just going to give false hope to anyone who's trying it for the first time. It's not too bad. 
Um, it just it just takes a, call, a little bit of practice, a little bit of time. You'll get it, no problem. See, like that looks a lot better than it did the first time around. And uh, next thing I want to do is maybe start on the second floor. Or should I put a roof in? Maybe I'll try to put a roof in first. I'm not sure what type of roof I want to use. Do I want to make this look nice and smooth? Do I want to make it look Raider-y-ish? I'm not sure. Well, um, you know, let's let's just start with the flat roof. Let's see how that looks, and uh, we'll check that out. Yeah, we'll roof this. We'll get uh the next. Oh, nothing more can be built. All right, all right. Well, uh, on to getting some guns then. Uh, thanks for watching this video. It was a little shorter. I didn't get that much done, but uh. It's a, it's a work in progress. Anyway, thanks for your time. Thanks for stopping again. Thanks also again uh, to the new subscribers for subscribing, and I'll catch you guys later. Bye now.